A handful of species on earth share a seemingly mysterious trait, a menstrual cycle. We are one of the selected few mammals on earth that menstruate and we also do it more than any other animal. Even though it's a waste of nutrients and can be a physical inconvenience. So, where is the sense in this uncommon biological process? Pharmacy D help you to understand the mystery of menstruation. But before that, take two seconds and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit the subscribe button and promote knowledge by sharing my videos. Now let's get into the mystery of menstruation. A period or menstruation is normal vaginal bleeding that is a natural part of a healthy monthly cycle for a person with a uterus and ovaries. Every month in the years between puberty and menopause, your body ready itself for pregnancy. The lining of your uterus thickens and an egg grows and is released from one of your ovaries. If pregnancy does not occur, estrogen and progesterone levels fall eventually hitting a level that tells your body to begin menstruation. During your period, the uterus sheds its lining and it's passed along with some blood out of the body through the vagina. The average person who menstruates loses about 2 to 3 tablespoons of blood during their period. The time between periods typically averages 28 days with bleeding typically lasting around 4 to 5 days. However, People can experience longer time between periods and fewer or more days of bleeding and still have totally regular periods. So the main question is, why do women have periods? As a woman, your periods is your body's way of releasing tissue that it no longer needs. Every month, your body prepares for pregnancy. The lining of your uterus gets thicker as preparation for nurturing a fertilized egg. An egg is released and is ready to be fertilized and settle in the lining of your uterus. If the egg is not fertilized, your body no longer needs the thicker lining of the uterus. So it starts to break down and is eventually expelled along with some blood from your vagina. This is your period and once it's over, the process starts all over again. Another important point to think about is that not all women have period. But that's another topic of discussion that we might cover in our upcoming videos. For a woman to have regular periods, the fallen needs to be functioning properly. Number one, hypothalamus. Number two, pituitary glands. Number three, ovaries. And number four, uterus. Dear viewers, that's all about why do women have periods. Hope this video will help you to understand the mystery behind your period. If you still have any questions, please write them down in the comment section below and we will try to get back to you as soon as possible. Till then, take care, stay healthy and stay safe.